Hey everyone, welcome back to The Silver Lining here on YouTube, or welcome if you're new here. I'm Sarah and today is the first Friday of the month, which means it's time for 10 Minutes Better. Ten Minutes Better is an open collaboration that is hosted by my sweet friend Melinda. Her channel is Melinda Plain and Simple, and each first Friday of the month, we do Ten Minutes Better, where we make something a little bit better in our lives, in our homes. And I'm going to take you along with me today as we get totally personal. Okay, so I'm going to take you on a little bit of a journey. <laughs> that I went on as I was trying to prepare for this 10 minutes better. I had decided several months ago that I wanted a new purse. And currently my purse that I have, there's nothing wrong with it. I got it a couple years ago for Christmas. I actually really like it. It has two zippers and it has this little middle compartment where my phone fits perfectly. I swapped out the strap shortly after I got it because I really like these guitar strap style and it fits over my shoulder can't really see it but it fits over my shoulder so it keeps me hands free that's one of my favorite things about a purse is that <laughs> as i've gotten older i prefer having something over my shoulder i've considered doing a backpack also keeps you hands free but this particular style and size has really worked for me for probably about two years is what i've had i got it christmas so maybe a year and a half, two and a half years, I don't know. But I've had it for a little while. So when I first started looking, I'm searching Amazon, of course. Who has time to go to the store? I actually settled on this purse that I liked a lot. It actually has three zippers here. So I thought, okay, this is perfect. It also has a zipper pouch on the back. So easy places for my phone to store and all those things. Well, when I got it, I decided it was too similar to what I had and not worth the money that I paid to have something so similar. So I'm returning that one. Thank you, Amazon, for your free returns. So I ordered a different one in its place, and I actually did film it thinking that I was going to switch purses, so I'll share that with you right here. So here's my current crossbody. It's kind of a taupe. It has two zippers across the top. One has just some lotion, hand sanitizer, a pen and pad of paper. The other one has my wallet. And then in this pouch, I have some feminine supplies and my keys. And in this little pouch, I always really liked it because it holds my phone so easily. It does not zip and it's just securely tucked in there whenever I would tuck it in there. So what I'm switching to is one a little bit bigger. You're experiencing this right along with me. I actually just ordered this from Amazon. So I will link it in my description box if it becomes something that you're interested in. It comes really nicely packaged. As you can see, it has this soft bag to protect it. And it's super pretty. It has kind of a gray and beige pattern. And the handles are sort of a beige cream color. And they have a little bit of red accents around the stitching. It also has this little lock accessory, which this um, blue part comes off, but I want to make sure that the bag is going to work before I unwrap all of the uh, extra, extra pieces. So it opens up. It has a really wide mouth. This piece actually will go through and it becomes a drawstring. Oh, it is a lot bigger, but I was wanting something that could hold quite a bit more. Not that I'll be carrying quite a bit more, but just that it has the room to hold a little bit more when I need it. The other thing that I'm gonna do besides switching purses is to switch to my favorite wallet as well. in here so good I can just drop it right in the purse and no hassle in getting it in or out. Usually I would like a zipper but I also like being able to open the purse completely up and seeing what's inside. So I actually think I'm gonna like that feature. The other thing that it has in addition to these handbag straps is it has a shoulder strap. 
So inside this bag, there is a zipper pocket, which I really like because I keep items in this zipper pocket that's in this purse. A couple of feminine items, like I had said, as well as keys to my car, which I don't have a key to put in the ignition, so they just stay in my purse and keys to my job and um oh what is this thing called a little the apple finder thing <laughs> in this last pocket of my purse is just a hand lotion hand sanitizer a pen and a small pad of paper a couple of lip colors a chapstick and a little band-aid holder and then that's it that was all that i ever carried in this purse you guys i went through all the motions with this purse i really did like the size and the shape of it i got everything switched over from my other purse and once i went to go try it on number one i realized that i don't really like the handbag part of it and when I put it over my shoulder I felt like it was a little bit too bulky on my hip but the deciding factor when I had it on was that there's no outside pocket so there's no easy way for me to reach for my phone in and out of this particular purse so unfortunately this purse did not make the cut and I was back to the drawing board so if you're keeping track that is the second purse that I tried in my hunt for the perfect bag and this third option that I found is actually a set. It was on a lightning deal, so I got, I think there were four different pieces that I got, and I thought this would be perfect because then I can switch it up if I want to. So anyway, I filmed that as well, swapped purses again, and if you're still with me, I'll show you that as well right now. I filmed just like I'd filmed it before. I really thought that this particular set was going to be a winner for me. I had switched back everything to my current purse from before and I was going to go through all the motions and switch purses here on film with you. I will say that I am still really impressed with the quality of this set. I like how it came packaged. I like the different sizes and the purse that I wanted to use was the smaller of the two purses that you see in this particular clip. It has the handle straps and that was kind of the style that I thought was going to be something that I liked. Turns out, spoiler alert, it's not something that I love. <laughs> so I will also link all of the purses that I've shown in this video down below because like I said overall the quality of all of them has been really good it's just for different reasons they didn't work particularly for me I even went through and switched out my wallet again into this denim one I had actually used this one before it's one that I had at home and I really like it you'll see at the end why this set didn't quite work for me and what I ended up using instead I really liked how everything fit in this purse. I liked the size of it. It wasn't too big, but as you can see, now that I'm getting the shoulder strap out and put getting ready to connect it, oh, there it is. 
it doesn't have any D clips on the sides to connect the shoulder strap. So that was a no go for me for that reason. So at this point now, it's a thing, right? So I really had to evaluate whether or not me getting a new purse was really something that I needed versus something that I actually just wanted. And so what I decided to do was keep my purse and purchase a new strap. I mentioned earlier that I really like those guitar strap. They come in tons of different styles and patterns. And so I just decided on one that I thought was really fitting for this season and fits my personality well. So here's my current purse. Once again, I really do like the way that everything fits perfect. I like this snug little cell phone pouch. So here's what I've decided to do. This I purchased separately whenever I got this purse because it came with just a strap that matches this same material and same color. So I wanted something that matched. This came in the mail today. I think it was like $10.99 and there are tons of patterns to choose from. So this is what I decided for this summer. It's kind of a floral pattern. It still has the gold accents and it's a little bit thicker which I knew going into it but it still has the same sort of cream taupe color undertones so it still goes with it but it freshens up the look quite a bit thank you guys so much for going on this journey towards better for me it was definitely totally personal i am really excited to have my purse refreshed without having to spend too much money in the end i suppose this 10 minutes better could have actually been 10 seconds better had i not tried to change something that actually didn't need to be changed i hope that you enjoyed your time here on my channel leave me a thumbs up before you leave so that i know that you were here be sure and check out the playlist in my description box you can check out what all the other ladies are doing that is totally personal to them for 10 minutes better. Thanks again to Melinda for hosting and thank you all for being here. I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.